on Sunday, um, for Family Home Evening, we talked about how to be a good family member. And to be a good family member meant to, not to be selfish. And and my mom asked us um, if we wanted to be a family member. And we all said yes, except I got mad and upset and said no. And my mom said that we could try it for a week. And that meant I had to do everything for myself. And since I wasn't part of the family, um, I couldn't join fa the family for family prayers. And then it was time for bed, and I felt real bad, and I tried to pray to have Heavenly Father, and I felt like Heavenly Father wanted me to change my mind. So I changed my mind and decided to be part of the family. So I went and told my mom that I changed my mind and gave her a big hug, and then I felt much better. Train up a child in the way he should go, and when he is old, he will not depart from it. Today there are many problems in our society, and so many of these problems are symptoms of failure in the home. President Benson has said, if we continue with present trends, we can expect to have more emotionally disturbed young people, more divorce, more depression, and more suicide. The family is the most effective place to instill lasting values in its members where family life is strong and based on principles and practices of the gospel of Jesus Christ. These problems do not as readily appear. Each child enters the world a free agent. And I think the real temptation as a parent is to withdraw some of that free agency. And that's the difficult part of parenting, to allow children to make appropriate decisions. I think it's a dangerous thing to try to tell children that everything is simple. I think the gospel itself is simple, but there are lots of complicated issues, and to have a patsy answer for everything I think is a mistake, because the world just isn't that way. We strengthen our children when we live with courage around them, and we not only uh, tell them, but we show them and walk with them so that they would know that what we say and what we live are the same. I think parents continue being parents after the children are raised. I depend on my mother a lot. I still look to her as my best friend. So I don't think there's a specific age when you say, wow, it's all done. <laughs> 